the RM here from 10.620 is ACT2. Um, today we will discuss about data types and arrays, uh, particularly about characters. And uh, uh, before we delve into our discussion, uh, if you like this video, please comment and share. And don't forget to subscribe my channel. And, uh, character. Um, yeah, data type is um, defined as car in Java, and uh, uh, and uh, this is a Unicode representation of characters, and it is a sixteen bit wide uh, data type, and so it can uh, represent um, um, characters up to 65,000 so there are no negative characters so there is no negative number in characters so uh, we can represent 65,000 uh, characters with a, a character data type and uh, as of now it can handle um, all of the languages available in the world letters in the world so we will see later on uh, how we can uh, manipulate characters so a character ranges from 0 to 65,000 and each number has got its own specific um, characters assigned to it let's go to our ID and exercise on character so we can uh, uh, declare characters using the keyword car and then um, give uh, a valid identifier my car is a valid identifier so we can initialize it here or in another line so here I can say um, uh, a so when you declare characters you use single quotes um, to put um, the character um, I could say car my name car okay. and in single quotes nine is also a valid character I can also um, declare character using integer uh, if I literals so my int car um, hundred forty one so if I put this one this um, is also taken as a valid input I can also use uh, um, a hexadecimal number which is commonly used in Unicode characters and declare uh, car my hexa car and I could use hmm. so here um, um, in single quotation uh, slash u indicates that this is a hexadecimal number and 1200 is a hexadecimal number that means base 16 number so this is a unicode value for the Amharic letter ha so <coughs> uh, we can look into um, the output uh, here okay and so here we can say the the card value 
of 141 is my end car this is the number 141 we will see what will be the output for uh, this one or we can use uh, the same statement to the car value of let's say the hexa as well as zero hexa as well as zero zero uh, would be my hexa car. so if we compile this one we will uh, see that <coughs> value You see the uh, most likely 141 is a special character with a space. Let's make it uh, 250, 255 and see what will happen. Uh, as you can see, the value of hexa 1200 is looks like in English a capital U but this is the letter H in Amharic <clears throat> so this is I think uh, the letter Y with two columns above it, it must be a letter from some language. Um, uh, so any integer type um, up to 65,500 is a valid character and you can have an output there. Let's say 65. 1575 would it be valid yeah this is a valid character uh, uh, we can also change um, 141 to the decimal value of this uh, hexadecimal number and we will get the same result so if we convert this hexadecimal value to decimal value it will be 4608 and uh, if we print uh, this uh, value we will have the same characters the Amharika in both cases let's see that you see here so the inter the decimal value is 4608 and it is r uh, and the hexadecimal value is 1200 so um, the output is uh, again h uh, so we can use the decimal value number from 0 to uh, 65500 um 30 something and we can use the uh, decimal value up to that value up to the decimal representation of 65,500 something so both ways we get the same result